Hello vlog, welcome to another date night video. Thursday and usually our day nights are on Fridays but Will and I wanted to go see a movie this week because we have movie vouchers and they expire at the end of September so I'm like we need to use them up so we were gonna go see a movie tomorrow and I looked at the cinema that the vouchers are for and the only movie that looked good was this movie called Words on Bathroom Walls that I'd seen previews for and it has the guy from the Looking for Alaska Hulu adaptation and so I was like wow that looks really good I was like we should go see that one and I looked and the only time they're playing it is tonight at 6.50 and like they're not playing it tomorrow or at all after today and so I'm like well that sucks so we decided to move date night to tonight so we could go see that movie okay so it is about almost five right now and I got I've been pretty productive today. I finished um, an assignment and I took a quiz for a class and I actually did really well on the quiz and I was kind of afraid that I wasn't going to, but it turned out okay, which is awesome. Um, and I got video edited. I got tomorrow's video because today's Thursday, so I got my Friday video edited and I'll hopefully put it up before we leave. So now I think I'm gonna head over to the bathroom and start doing my hair and makeup. Hello again and welcome back to my bathroom. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hair and makeup. Like I said, my hair actually looks kind of decent today. So I think I might leave it pretty close to how it is. Maybe throw some bobby pins in, I don't know. You guys really need to start sending me ideas to talk about during um, these get ready with me portions because I am just, like I said before, I'm bad at coming up with ideas. So. That's your task. Go on the comments right now. Comment something you want me to talk about. It could be literally anything. I don't care. I just need something. <laughs> kind of like an ongoing um, get ready with me uh, conversation. But you remember how my Amazon got hacked twice now? Well, it got hacked again. I'm not even joking. I've literally changed my password th three times now. And I've called them and... Someone just keeps getting in and I, like I said, I've changed my password to my Amazon and my email several times and they're like hard passwords too. Like I can't even remember them. I had to like write them down because they're just like very difficult passwords and I'm like, how is this happening? And so this time I went through and I did like the two step security thing that you can do on Amazon and on your Gmail. So I went through that and I actually found a bunch of websites that my Gmail was linked to that had, you know, like my Gmail on it, but like were sites that I don't use anymore. Like things for like past school projects and whatever, just like things that I don't need. So I like deleted my account from those sites. So hopefully maybe that was the issue. Maybe it'll solve it or help, I don't know. But uh at this rate, I literally don't know what to do to fix this. It's just really making me irritated. So, how have you guys been? Let me know in the comments, like, how you're doing with corona, with quarantine. Are you still in quarantine? How is corona where you are? Is it, like, still pretty bad? Or if, like, if you're in another country, like, definitely let me know because I don't really know a whole lot about how other countries are doing. I just know how America is doing because <laughs> that's where I live. Here, it's still pretty bad, I think. The U.S. is one of the highest corona rates right now. If you guys haven't watched this yet, last week for date night, Will and I, like we had our date night, but then we also went to um, a place called Hummel Park, which is in Omaha. It's like pretty like no well known here. Um, basically, it's just like this like haunted park, and people go there to get spooked. And so last week. <laughs> Will's roommate was like, let's go to Hummel Park. And I was like, yeah, this is like a great idea in the middle of the night. Like, yep, that's a wonderful idea. But we did it anyway. <laughs> and it was very scary. And I, I don't know why I decided to do this. But last night I decided to start editing the vlog because like I wasn't ready to go to bed yet. And I wanted to do something productive. So I was like, well, I could edit the vlog because I wanted it to go up today which it did so make sure you go check it out <laughs> but so I was editing it and it was probably like one in the morning and I just got really scared 
<laughs> while, while editing it and thankfully my roommate Faith was awake so I like got up and like went to her room I'm like Faith I'm scared <laughs> and so I ended up editing most of it in her room because I could not be alone while editing that like I don't know why I wanted to edit that in the middle of the night probably not my best idea but I think it turned out pretty good I kind of like I added like spooky music in the background and stuff so it's definitely like good for like our Halloween vibes since October's coming up so like definitely go check that out it's pretty spooky okay I don't know what color to do what, co what color should I do guys probably a spark oh no Okay, so fun fact, you see this shelf over here? So the other day I was, I don't know what I was doing, something in the bathroom, I think I was getting in the shower or something, and uh, I bumped it with my elbow and it fell down and my makeup palette went flying. And so now this one is like broken and cracked, which really sucks, but it's still in there, so that's good. Okay, I honestly like don't think I'm gonna do much else today. Just cause I don't really feel like putting on a lot of makeup. It's too much work, guys. I, I'm not built for this. <laughs> I am gonna go get my good lip liner though. I swear this stuff is the best stuff in the entire world. I freaking love this lip liner. And we're done. <laughs> that was quick. Okay, so here's today's look. Um, it's just, I'm actually wearing two tank tops. One, because this top one is a little too see-through. So, two tank tops, a flannel, and then my black high-waisted shorts. Because this is the only high-waisted shorts that I have, and I really like them. And I kind of like how this look is more, like, simple. So, yeah. I'll see you when I get ready to leave to go get Will. Okay, we're walking to the cinema, because it's pretty close to Will's dorm. Hunter joined us. And, yeah, we're going to go see, what's it called? Words on bathroom walls? Something like that. Something like that. And I'm really excited because Alexandra and Morgan saw this and they said it was really good, so pretty excited. Looks like it has the same aesthetic as like uh, every other YA movie. Yeah, the sun is also a star. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, all those. All movies. of those. Yep. Okay, we're in the theater and we got popcorn and a drink. So like our school gave us like vouchers, so we get free movie, free popcorn, and a free drink, which is really amazing because like you know it'd be a lot. I think it's like eleven dollars for a popcorn and a drink. That's not including the movie ticket, so like, this is actually a really good deal. But yeah, we're gonna go to the movie soon. It's right over here. Theater 6, right there. And I got an Icy instead of Pop. And I'm really excited because I like Icy's. And usually they're pretty expensive. And I got this one for free, so I'm really excited about it. Will and Hunter are taking too long. I have extra straw. I have a straw. Here, have one for your popcorn. What? I don't need a straw. Okay, thanks. My popcorn has a straw. Can I help you? Yeah. Oh. Uh, say something funny. Something funny. Ha ah, ha ha. Very witty. You ready? Yeah. What'd you think? It was good. How good? Very good. Uh, one to ten, I would give it at least a seven. Me too. Maybe an eight. Maybe an eight. I want to read the book now. I didn't even know there was a book, but now I do, and now I want to read it. Yeah. It yeah. seemed... I, I didn't even know that it was based off of a book, but just like looking at the poster and kind of hearing what it was about, yeah, I could tell it was based off of a book. Plus it had, I don't know what's his name, but he also played in um, The Fall of Our Stars. No, Looking for Alaska. That was something? Oh. I know, the movie was good. I really liked it. It had me tearing up. Me too, I cried. Did you like it? Yeah, it was good. What's your, what's your star rating? Out of what? 10. 10? Yeah. Oh. Six or seven. Really? Part of the view. Yeah. You are the view. What are you talking about? Oh. <laughs> so we finished the movie. We walked back to Will's dorm. 
Hunter went inside to grab his keys because he's gonna drive us to Sonic so we can get smoothies. Smoothies and drinks. Something. And we got <laughs> a lot of popcorn left and I am full on popcorn, which is surprising because I don't know, I'm not a big popcorn person. Me neither. The movie was so good. Highly recommend it. Um, it had really good like mental health representation, like some of the best I've seen probably in a movie. And then also it had good like role reversal, you know, like the standard female, standard male roles were reversed. Mm -hmm. And so I like that like out of the box thinking. And now we're waiting for Hunter. So is that book now on your TBR? Maybe. Possibly. I might try to read it. Maybe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we ended up at Sonic. Yep. What did we get? Mango? Peach mango slush. Hunter, what did you get? Cookie dough. Cookie dough what? Splash. Splash. Croissant. <laughs> Is it good? It's good, yeah. Hey guys, Editing Ebony. I'm over here editing last week's date night vlog and I realized I didn't close it out so sorry about that but thank you all so much for watching this vlog if you liked it please make sure you are subscribed down below so you don't miss any future date night vlogs and if you want to follow me on social media all my links are in the description box down below as always thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye